everyone. It is Wednesday, September 16th, of course, in 2020. I haven't posted in a while because I have been very busy. I quit my job at the hospital because I had to stay home and homeschool my son Aiden, who is in first grade. And I also have a three-year-old, Kyson, who is in like pre-preschool. So I have Aiden who has school online every day, ranging from 10.20 to 3.10. So that's a whole chunk of my day. I could not continue to go to work. I There was no way I could just work weekends. And of course, my battery is blinking. One moment. Okay, I'm back. So, with that being said, with homeschool, I had to quit my job, of course, and then stay home with him all day. So, I have to supplement my income. My income. I have to supplement my income. Um, so, I started babysitting two kids and they're first grade and third grade. Aiden is on a all online virtual schooling till January, which I did not know. Kind of makes me mad because I wanted him to go back to school. Even though I had to wear a stupid mask all day long, I wanted him to go back to school and get that interaction with other kids. And he's not getting that. Well, he is with two kids. But I wanted him to be able to be around his friends and to get into a routine. With that being said, I have been very busy trying to figure out a new filming, editing, uploading schedule. So I figured that with the new hybrid 50-50 is what they're calling it, is what my son's school is doing, is on... <laughs> Tuesdays and Thursdays one color will go and Wednesdays and Fridays the other color will go and then on Mondays every other Monday they'll switch colors so the kids I watch they're on one color so on the days that they go to school then I will film because I only have you know my two boys Aiden and Kyson so today is that day and I will get the kids in about 10 minutes or so um, they come over around 7 7 30 every morning and then we get them breakfast and then we kind of go from there it depends on the days now of what we're going to do but i'm basically a homeschool mom for the time being and it's very stressful <laughs> i um am not meant to be a teacher i found that out years ago that i'm not meant to be a teacher i cannot handle little kids all day long that have to learn math and reading and writing that's a little over my area of expertise I am more medical <laughs> I have found that out but I'm gonna take you along in our day today as a mom of two show you our homeschool routine I hope you guys enjoy this video and right now we're just waiting for the boys to wake up um, the boys normally don't wake up until like 8 something which that is okay because they even though their bedtime I said at 8 o'clock they do not fall asleep until like 10 so them sleeping into 8 is a very good thing I'm going to get me some breakfast or at least coffee before the kids get here because I need to get my coffee done and drink I because I need to get my coffee because I need to get my coffee in and because I'm really tired and then I need to do my devotional that I do every day. And then we'll see where we're at from there. So let's get this coffee. Why do I make things complicated? Why do I lose all my control? Oh, oh. I keep on letting my bad habits make us both come crashing to the floor. Something to save us. With strangers. And there you have it. I have my coffee made. I don't put ice in my coffee because it's cold already and it takes up space so I don't get as much. But I am using the Stoke Cold Brew Coffee and I get that from Aldi. And then I also found these um, creamers from Aldi. They're the brand 
Friendly Farms and I'm trying the butter cookie this week because last week and the week before I had, what did I have? Oh, I had like a coconut and then I had, what did I have? I had a coconut and, oh, hazelnut. I had coconut and hazelnut and um, I was not a fan of the coconut. The hazelnut was okay, but I was not a fan of the coconut. So I'm going to drink my coffee and go sit at the desk and do my devotional and wait for the kids to show up. Let's hope I don't spill my coffee before I get it anywhere. Mm -hmm. Okay, light on. And I wanted to show you guys my desk real quick just in case you want to know. So, it's kind of messy, but there's, you know, pens, pencils, there's my Young Living diffuser. I started Young Living, so excited. <laughs> I've been doing that for probably about two weeks now. And then, you know, my beautiful iMac. Got some stuff over there. That's a kid's toy right here that I keep over here because it annoys the crap out of me. But there's my beautiful desk. And then out here, backyard's a mess, I know. I can see the gate, so when I know the kids get here. So, let's get doing my devotional and drinking my coffee this morning. So, I wanted to share with you guys what I've been doing for my uh, word of the day, or not word, <laughs> verse of the day. I have just been using the Bible app, looks like that on your phone, and I open it up and it has the verse of the day right here and I just click on it if I haven't read it then I highlight it in my purple so it's now purple so I will read that and then I have this little book right here I will write it down today's date what it is and then I will go from there I am looking for an actual like devotional to choose from so if you have any actual devotional books i would love to hear those so you can leave those down in the comment be in the comments below or you can find me on any social media i am mostly on instagram so if that is easiest for you i would go find it over there but i'm gonna get to my my god time Trying to make up your mind like you need more time You've already spent most of mine Even when your words fail, you try to keep it light You realize I'm done right But you can be honest I don't appreciate your lies It's about damn time you get it right I'm going to show you guys what my book looks like that I do my Bible verse of the day in. I had it for years. I don't even remember where I got it. It's probably Walmart or Target. But I love the top of it and I wish every book could be like this. So this book, it just says Hello Lovely on it. And then I open it up and it looks like this. I like the top part because it has the months at the top and then the days. And you can circle what days you do. And I just kind of write my verse of the day. And what book it's from. And then the verse itself. And I really like it. Because it keeps everything organized. And it also has this little tassel. I think is what you call it. It's like a bookmark. So you can always know where you're at. And I am done with this page so i will flip it over and i will start a new day tomorrow so it's all blank and pretty and perfect after my devotional i've been trying to get out my planner and see what i have going for that day because there is a lot going on right now in my life <laughs> and so today i see that aiden has a reading session with his teacher at 10 o'clock so instead of his special which is okay i never called any extra stuff like art math or not math art music um 
computer class, gym. We never called them specials at my school because we had them on like a daily basis. And it was confusing that his are called specials because he doesn't have them every day or at least the same one every day like he on monday he had gym and tuesday he had art he doesn't have anything today and then tomorrow he has library and then has nothing on friday so he doesn't have one every day but i like to open my um planner up and then i also like to write my bible verse in my daily planner because i don't know i like to write it in multiple spots so i can always know what i did that day so i pretty much am set for the day now i know what's going on i have an alarm set for the kids school bus um so i can walk them out there to the school bus um other than that, I'm just going to wait for the kids to get here. It's 7.30 right now, so they should be showing up anytime. And I'm going to continue drinking my coffee. And then we'll wait for Aiden and Kyson to wake up. So, that should be fun. And if you want to know, I will not be showing the kids I babysit on camera because of privacy reasons. But I will do like a homeschool area um, video that will be up on my other channel, Basics with Brianna and um, I would stay tuned for that because even though this is how it looks right now I'm going to change some things up so I'll see you guys uh, when the boys wake up so it's 8 17 getting the kids on the bus was a success but it is freezing outside it is so cold it's 49 degrees and I'm freezing my butt off. But got back in the house after taking the other kids to the bus stop. Only Kyson is awake. Aiden's still sleeping, but that's okay. So I got my little baby right here. Say hi! Look at that chocolate face. <laughs> Look at your chocolate face. Oh my goodness. <laughs> what? I ate a chocolate pop tart. You did eat a chocolate pop tart and you had chocolate milk, didn't you? <laughs> so, he has ate his pop tart. He only had one, but that's okay. I made him some chocolate milk. Now I have to get myself some breakfast and wait for Aiden to wake up. And if he doesn't wake up, probably by 9 o'clock, I have to wake him up. Whew, I'm out of breath. <laughs> Exercise induced asthma sucks. Um, but I don't know what I want for breakfast. I don't know if I want a bagel. I don't know if I want a waffle. I don't know what I want. So we're gonna see what it has. Maybe I'll just have a perfect bar. So I got this perfect bar to so show them on my Instagram. And I think we're going to do the, whoa, focus, dark <laughs> chocolate chip peanut butter. So, I'm going to have perfect bar with my coffee, and I don't know what else we're going to do for now. i to wait till Aiden wakes up before we can do anything. So, I'll probably just cuddle with Kai Kai. You want to cuddle with Mommy? Oh, no, you don't want to cuddle with mommy. Can I sit in my seat? What's that? I'll show you. Can I sit in my seat? Okay. And then you can sit with mommy. Come here, my baby boy. Mm. I love cuddles. Love you. Stumbling out of bed And I still got you in my head From all those pretty words you said It's like I'm wasted Every time I see your face I'm losing track of time and space I don't know where I am It's like I'm wasted And I won't waste it And I promise that I I will stand by you forever I can't get you out of my Hi, Bob. 
morning. Good morning. Are you cold? And you want to eat breakfast? Hey. Do you want to eat breakfast? Not right now. No. So Aiden is awake and he's picking out some cereal to eat. That's what he wants for breakfast. There's some cereal, but we have to eat what is in the containers before I open up new things. Say hi. Grumpy. Very grumpy this morning, but I'm going to make him some chocolate milk just like I did Kaisa. So hopefully that will cheer him up and he won't be so cranky. I wish I had a little more time with you, baby. Time to figure out what this could be. What do you say? Mm. Oh, you got food in your mouth? Mm. What do you say that I gave you um, chocolate milk? So, this is Aiden's computer that Grandma is letting us borrow until school can give us one for Aiden. But I am getting him set up for his reading meeting with his teacher. And um, after they're done with that, then he'll have a little break, which is probably where I will do lunch. Aiden? Do you have math homework? I'll do that. And tricky word review. Apparently my kid had homework and did not tell me. So we'll be doing this later tonight, understand? Mommy's gonna have to start checking this every day now, aren't we? Right here, you have math, or sentence matching, and tricky word review. That was supposed to be due on Monday. And it didn't get done. What you gotta say for yourself? So we got Aiden set up right here. He is gonna be doing his one-on-one -on -one reading with his teacher. And then I have Kyson set up down here. He normally plays a game, but he's watching an educational video on Netflix. Kyson is watching the show called Alpha Blocks. It's about um sounds letters what they make the words they make and there's one. okay and so he's watching that aiden is getting ready to go on with his teacher to do a one-on-one -on -one reading session to determine how much he can read and how well he can read and then i think that's supposed to be like 20 minutes to a half hour long and then we'll have a little break before class starts at 11:55. so i'll probably get them some lunch and then, yeah, we'll start the actual class day. So that's when I'll do some things with Kyson. I have um, flashcards for him. We have his preschool book, um, stuff like that to do with him. So if I can do that with him today, then I'll film that and we'll do that with Kyson. Otherwise, Aiden will have his class and he knows what to do in his class. So. I gotta get ready to help him with his reading session if he needs it, so we're going to wait for that to start. I go straight from the bank, gassing up the tank, cranking up the radio, playing old Hank, it ain't that long, till I'm back at the pond. Your teacher says you have to retake one of your reading tests. Okay, we're gonna do this together, but I can't help you. You do the yellow first. Aiden? No, we have to do just this one. Okay. 
So I'm gonna help you, but I cannot give you the answers. Understand? Baby, get a little stuck. It's a Saturday tour ride. Percy Priest is the spot. To take the blues away. We're on a boat. We're feeling fine. Drinking Tennessee whiskey, a big blue sky. What are you eating? Pop tart. Yeah, are you eating some more pop tart? Didn't you have that for breakfast? Yep. So you ate one at breakfast and you're eating one now? I'm eating one now. Mm, you're so sweet. I love you. I will. <laughs> okay, remember, stir your chocolate milk before you drink it. Okay. I am going to figure out what to get for lunch. So, Kyson was playing on the computer. <laughs> the computer was unplugged, so it died. So, now what do you want to do? Do you want to play your flashcards? No. Or do I you want to draw in your book? I want to play my tablet. No, no tablet right now. You want to flashcards or draw in your book? No, in my book. Yeah, you do. I have your book right here. Can you get it? Oh. Okay, I'm going to show them real quick what your book is, okay? I'm going to get my book. So this is the book I have for Kyson. It used to be Aiden's, and Aiden's used a little bit of it, but for the most part, it's not used that much. The front is, but we have it for Mr. Tyson. <laughs> so, take your book, go sit at your desk. Aiden Lyle, that's enough. It's gone. No, look down here, look down here. Look down here. It's right there. There you go. Oh, it is. Can you Here. move it? Yes, I will move it. There. So I can call her. So you can call her. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. I put my box to unzip it. Sit on your butt. Never thought I'd be so far from home. Never thought a love could grow so cold. you do? Uh, I fell off my chair. You fell off your chair? Yeah. Are you okay? Can you tell me that I fell off my chair? Can you look at me? Are you okay? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, you pick up your stuff. Can you tell Aiden? You want me to tell Aiden? Life changes as we know it You do what you can, you just get through it It's a mystery How people can get by On as little love as you 